Late night time. So I'm just gonna do some, some stuff here. Turns off that, that turns off that. There we go. Save this. All right, so this is the custom 50 that I built, and this thing is. Oh, I don't know if I just moved that chair. It's probably a bad thing if I did. Uh, it doesn't matter, I guess. So, look. I'm going to turn everything off. This thing's not even on one. It's very quiet. If you listen to me talk, we'll do some clean tones for a second. Set this delay to uh, 420 milliseconds. Oh, I'm just going to do both delays at 420. That dual delay going on here. 420. Okay. Turn my compressor on. So I got, right now I got a univibe going on, reverb, and a delay. But it doesn't have very much delay. Whoa. That's strange. Turn that feedback up. Sorry. It doesn't have that. Maybe it's... Weird. Something's wrong with my delays. Why is it not? I don't have...
still not happy with it. One of them is lacking here. So we got it up to 60 and 60. Six. 50. Let's do this. 60. And there we go. Um, turn this up a little bit. Just so we can hear it. Here we go again. These ain't even the right settings, but it shows you that you can actually get some David Gilmore tones here out of this amp. Turn the gain 
up a little on this bad boy. I'm making this set, this preset right now as we go. I can hear the clean in the hand still. So I think what I need to, I don't know how to copy this. Let me open this up, click this, copy device. I wanna add it here, paste. No, I don't wanna split. I'm trying to, I copy it. Where's my paste? I don't know how to... I copied that. So if I take that, I copy. Oh, I can just... Um, maybe if I... I'm just going to put... I'm just gonna put a Y in there for now. And then if I hit this, hit this and I paste. Oh, there's a lot of distortion now. So I that clean sound going. Quad cortex right now is the limitations of this amp because the amp is is beautiful without the distortions. Again, shit. So we just gotta. All we have on here is just reverb. <laughs> sounds beautiful I'm not really happy with the the gain the gains not working in the pedal with the delay so well I'm gonna have to really get to it to, to do it but 
But I think if I hit a tube screamer, that's not a tube screamer. That one's tube screamer. sounds really good clean. I'm literally on zero. Just cracked, dude. It's not. I can't sleep.
pedal. So, so, this is a big deal. Paid $1,700 for this pedal. Sometimes it's, it's awesome, sometimes it's not so awesome. Now, I've also had a compressor, and then I have a big muff, you know, and then I have an overdrive and a rat, and then I have a delay and a reverb, and I have my univibe. It seems to be going into a front of an amplifier, all those devices together, and their sum sound way better than this unit. Now there are certain things about this unit that's better for recording, but for analog purposes, I don't like the overdrives. Reverbs, univibes, choruses, flangers, phasers, any modulation is beautiful, but they just, their, their overdrives are horrendous. Anyway, that's a rough demo, dude.